Hello guys and welcome back to another Big Brother Titans review. Now guys, let us talk about last night's party in Big Brother's house. With also how Yemi completely ignores Kosi at the party. I mean Yemi practically danced with every female housemate except for Kosi. This was really sad to watch because he did all of this in front of her whilst Kosi was dancing alone at the dance floor. To be quite honest with you guys, nobody deserved to be treated the way that Yemi treated Kosi at the party last night. He practically blue ticked her. Well, Kosi saw that Yemi had no interest in dancing with her, so she decided to mingle with other housemates. Well, Miracle came to Kosi's rescue. After Miracle, it was Tabang who continued to dance with Kosi throughout the entire night until they both got tired and decided to sit down. After the party in the kitchen, we saw something that we've never seen before, which is Kosi and Sandra sharing a hug. After the hug, we saw the two ladies chatting to each other and practically making peace. Sandra even made a joke about, maybe this is probably the last time I get to talk to you since we are both drunk. We all know that the two ladies were not on speaking terms, of which we don't know what is the root of it. Could it be Yemi? The question is, would they have made peace if Yemi was still in the picture with Kosi? I was embarrassed yesterday, I won't lie, said Kosi when she was chatting with Theo this morning. Kosi continued to say that even though she doesn't care about what is happening between Yemi and Blue, but what was happening yesterday really embarrassed her in front of all the housemates. Kosi claims that after Yemi was done dancing with Blue, he approached her and asked her if she wanted to dance with him. Kosi refused the offer. Could this be because of the way that she was embarrassed that she saw that if she agrees to dance with Yemi, people would think that maybe she is acting like the house clown? Kosi even mentioned to Theo that some of the housemates feel sorry for her. She mentioned that... Jenny O approached her before the party and said, I'm sorry, I know that we are not friends, but I just wanted to know, are you okay? Well, is it too early to say that the ship between Yemi and Kosi has sank, or maybe there is a possibility that it will sail again? Feel free to drop a comment below and tell me what do you think about the way Yemi reacted at the party towards Kosi and the way that things are between the two, Kosi and Yemi. And if you still think there's a possibility of these two getting back together. Thank you for your time. Thank you for watching. And please do subscribe and like. Bye.